guys, this is Kirsten and this is another plan with me. And actually for once I have stuff to plan. So today I'm going to be doing a super duper fall week. I know you probably can't see it because as usual this camera and focusing but it in fact does say super duper fall. So that's the theme of this week. First day of fall is the 23rd of September so I figured this is the time to do it. And somehow over the course of my uh ever-growing planner addiction, I have acquired quite a number of fall-related stickers. So there's going to be quite a bit from quite a variety of shops. I'm not altogether sure if I'm going to use every single one, but I will probably be using a lot. Uh, the basics, of course, you guys, of course it's going to be from my shop, so this set in particular. But I'm also debating whether just to do this. Then I have this set. It's from my recent purchase from Sweet Bean Plans. And these are just ombre check boxes. I'm just going to be using them all because this is super duper fall week. Everything has to be super duper fall. And I'm probably going to end up using this. These are from, I believe, Stico. So I have these little cute accent pieces, very bronzy and awesome. Then I have these ones, which are a lot more matte, but also a lot bigger. Uh, these are like pumpkin patch. A lot of awesome pumpkin-y related things going on here. And let's get started, shall we? so out of it today it's a Friday I should know better than to film on a Friday but this is the way it turned out it looks so adorable if I don't mind if you don't mind me bragging and yeah basically it's just a way for me to welcome in fall since the first day is the 23rd if I didn't already mention it it just looks so beautiful it makes me like kind of prepared for fall <laughs> so far I have not been thrilled with fall Maybe this will trick myself. So in case you are wondering, this is from the set that I mentioned earlier. The letter stickers I just thought were kind of grungy and would fit the motif. They are Tim Holtz ideology. They're like label stickers. I don't have a Dymo label maker. And if you don't really want the hassle of getting one, these work just fine. They're a little bit of a pain to place. Like I totally make a mess of them, but they do add that nice little touch. And yeah, so if you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to leave them down below and I will get back to them as soon as possible. Hope you enjoyed my video. Bye. <laughs> 